okay, okay. Happy New Year. The light show on Belgrade's tallest skyscraper marked the festivities on Saturday evening. Hundreds gathered at the Kalimagdan Fortress with a beautiful view of Belgrade as the backdrop. The Serbian Prime Minister joined the festivities. I would like to say that I expect that in 2023 we will still further strengthen friendship and, and partnership between Serbia and, and China, between Serbian and Chinese people. And I would like to thank you for all of your support, uh, for all of the partnership, for all of the pr friendship and uh, for everything that uh, we have built together. After the official speeches, traditional Chinese dancers performed for the excited audience. And at the end, like many New Year's celebrations, a massive fireworks show. This year coincides with the 10th anniversary of President Xi Jinping's proposal for the Belt and Road Initiative. In the last 10 years, the relationship between Serbia and China has grown dramatically under this initiative. The relations between the two countries are at their historic peak. Trade is booming, transportation connections are re-established after COVID-19 restrictions were lifted, and the cultural exchanges are thriving. And a bit further from the Kalamagdan Fortress, on Belgrade's main street, people enjoyed Chinese food delicacies and some traditional art. The official celebrations here in Serbian capital are finished, but all these festivities will continue in many other towns across Serbia, towns that are closely connected to China, mostly by its economics and by culture. Year after year, the Chinese New Year celebrations here are growing in size as Serbia is eager to show its appreciation for the close ties with China.